Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to the free Unity assets for August 2022 and assets from other marketplaces too, where I'll feature some of the free Unreal assets for this month. And I've got a tutorial to convert those to use in Unity. So it's always good to have a good selection of stuff that's on offer. And be sure to check out all the links in the description and the video that I created just a few days ago, which shows you all the deals and savings that you can make across all Unity game dev and the other marketplaces to make thousands and thousands of dollars of savings. I'll put all the links down in the description and you can also check out my Patreon to get access to over 150 scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. So the first one is the food pack free demo, which is 55 low poly food assets. And we've got a selection of cakes, cookies, milkshakes, drinks, meats, fish, and loads of stuff in here. The next one is the coffee cup PBR. It's a really nice PBR item with a cool looking coffee texture on top. So I just thought it might be a really awesome one to include. The next one is the Greenlands one-handed melee weapons light. And it's a set of stylized hand-painted PBR textures with bold profiles, suitable for any type of game, RTS, MOBA, and other stuff like that with symmetrical UV maps and some cool little designs. The next one is the Polymorphic Grid. This is one of the most customizable style grids and it's a powerful system to creating simple games with optimized system. It uses a graph algorithm for the data and you can use different search trees for binary and otherwise and you can create different shapes, grids and the current demo is a top-down shooter. The next one is the new deck roguelike card game template, a template for an own single player roguelike style deck building game like is with Slay the Spire and other games like that. So as easy to use card editor to create new components and things, script scriptable object based architecture, ready to use with basic assets, open source and URP and the built in render pipeline in one. The next one is the Z serializer save and load system. And this is an ability to save, encrypt and load data to the hard drive with no extra coding required. So you can have persistent components, game objects, and you can serialize components within this for Unity. You can have asynchronous serialization, encryption, save multiple files, and there's no extra coding required. The next one is the Muscle Car American, which is a low poly muscle car, which is around 14,000 triangles with one particular texture and I think it looks like a really nice detail model. Next one is the shader calibration scene remastered and this is made for URP, HDRP and the builds in render pipeline so you can check out different materials and different lighting scenarios with skyboxes, textures, image effects and more. Next one is the handheld games and this is a selection of both SRP and HDRP style materials for these handheld games console with three different examples ranging from 2000 all the way down to about 600 triangles with 2k resolution in textures. The next one is we've got the Avasta procedural tile map generator and this is to start creating or generating a world in seconds and generate tile maps with 2d projects where you can have multiple algorithms which has support for multiple layers with the ability to play specific objects with a click of a button and just get you quickly started with generating a level. The next one is the mobile force field and this is a free solution for a shader to create a force field style effect with color selection for this particular object. The next one is the Rundo Runtime Editor and Inspector Hierarchy and Undo and this allows you all the basic components of the Unity style editor at runtime whether you need the Hierarchy Inspector undoing all the same user interface and user experience and you can add components, prefabs and have seamless play mode and serialization involved. The next one is the Industrial Sign Pack Free and this is a mixture of 25 prefab signs ranging from 12 to 60 triangles, all low poly assets, ready, lightweight with various different industrial style models. And there's two here from the same developer, which they have a couple on here and many on their store, which are low poly magical potions and destructible vegetation. And these are a load of bunch of 30 unique assets for the vegetation and 36 different potions and swappable materials for the potions themselves. And then last but not least for the Unity selection from the same developer is the free stylized bear and the free stylized human RPG, both with lots of animations, lots of different stylized textures 
and full packs for, for each of the specific characters suitable for all specific pipelines. So do be sure to check out all these assets and I'll leave all the links in the description and make sure you throw a like on this video and make sure you subscribe to always be kept up to date to what I'm making. And we're gonna move on to the Unreal Engine Marketplace assets for this month and of course I'll leave the link in the description to the Unity tutorial which will show you how to export these out. So number one is the big office environment, 800 square meters of sections and high quality equipment with 4K textures for the props, 18 different spaces with equipment and full environments, loads of high quality props and everything going on in here. The next one is the cartoon water shader and it's a highly stylized water shader with solver for coastlines, oceans and lakes. You can create different styles of parameters and you've got lots of different customization for underwater acoustics, wave simulation, foam and intersection with objects, refraction, waterfalls, and so much in here. The next one is the MySQL integration plugin that connects Unreal Engine to projects and SQL servers, so you can easily execute queries from blueprints to store and retrieve data from a database. So you can do this asynchronously, you can write in certain update queries, and you can write custom connecting things from the server to select different pieces of data. The next one is the Open World RPG Toolkit, which has features for open world areas, tasks, waypoint, tele teleportation points, compasses, quest systems, minimaps, interactions for different types, menus, icons, currencies, save systems. The next is the storage house set, which is a modular warehouse type of scenario with over 400 AAA style models and textures, ranging from storage props, for beautification with decals, floor tiles, master materials, and LODs for every single one of these. And then last but not least is the stylized Egypt, which is 96 different props, ranging from 20 to 7,000 triangles with LODs, 10 plants, 11 generalized props, and seven stones with over 124 different meshes, all ranging from 1024 to 4K resolution textures with a stylistic Egyptian environment. So as I said, be sure to check out all the links in the description and be sure to check out all the sales on the Humble Bundle, Unity Store, and the amazing Sinity sale, which is on now. So be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 150 different scripts, assets, and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Come and check out my great assets on the Unity Asset Store and on my website for big bonus savings on all of those assets. And I want to say a big thank you to all my patrons, including Peter Steiner, Hoagland Nygan, Raheem Whitaker, Jean Pommier, Manas Berikas, Terence Conrad, Gage Linston, Walter Dunson, Joseph Newman, Rene Leisure, Tofa Chambers, Kreshnik Halili, Christian Sellant, Benjamin Shankel, Alex Shen, Alyssa Faden, Daniel Jetajank, Lebrons, Stephen Mormon and Rob Winkle. And thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.